If you want to play this game, you have to get the ball in the hole, which means you're going to be faced with a lot of three and four foot putts to close out a match or to close out a round at some point. Let's keep it simple. It's a short putt, which means the less moving parts, the better. So we want to focus on creating a nice, simple pendulum-like stroke, which means no wrists and no body and head movement. So notice how my legs and hips are stable, my head is stable, and it's really just the unit of my arms, shoulders, and core moving back and forth, swinging the putter. Not jabbing at the ball, swinging the putter. Once you've got that down, you want to really establish your aim because accuracy is so important on short putts. Feel good about your line by deciding whether you are aiming center, edge, or outside the hole. You shouldn't be looking for more break than about a cup for a three or four foot putt. It's a short distance, and pins are not cut on super slopes on putting greens for the sake of pace of play and playability. So go ahead and pick your aiming point. This one I'm aiming just right center, and then I'm gonna square up my club face before I get my body set. I wanna make sure my face is perpendicular to the line I've chosen, and that way when I swing, I can keep it stable to that line. So I'm gonna go ahead and hit this putt, Perfect, fell right into the right center and held its line. So let's talk about pace. A lot of times golfers are guilty of wanting to take break out of their short putts, so they just hit it harder and straighter at the golf hole. But the issue with that is that if you don't hit it dead center and you do hit the edge of the hole, it's just gonna lip out or go so far by, you're gonna end up with another three or four footer coming back. So the key with pace is to hit the ball just hard enough that it would go by the hole only about 12 inches, something like this. You can see I've put an alignment rod down just behind the hole to create a practice station. I highly recommend this so that you can really focus on picking your line, matching it up with a good pace that'll help you make more putts, and of course, with that nice simple stroke, you know you're guaranteed to be able to close out that match much easier next time you're faced with a short one.